Today we're opening a 2003 Dark Magician deck. What's up guys, we're back with another epic video, and as you saw, we're opening that epic 10, but before that, we're gonna do a giveaway. I'll be giving away this Battles of Chaos first edition booster box. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, turn on notifications. Let me know what you wanna see out of this booster 10, booster pack 10, 10 with booster packs in it. What do you wanna see? We also have a few other packs to open. We're gonna be opening 10 OTS tournament pack 18 for some ultimate rares, and a Shadow Spectre special edition. So I think that'll be fun as well. Potential ghost rare in there, so let's get right into it. Let's see what we can pull. Okay, let's start with an OTS Tournament Pack 18. Let's go. Let's see what we can get. Ultimate Rares in here. So let's see if we can get one. We've got the Manju and the Destiny Hero Dasher. This was epic. Now it's like a dollar, I think. Manju was also epic, but they keep reprinting it, so it's probably not epic anymore. Rip uh, IOC $3 common. It's now more like a dollar or less, unfortunately. Let's try another pack. We have the uh, Gulvair, the Nordic Ascendant. We've got the Phantom Knights of Silent Boots and the Monk of the Tinny. This was a couple bucks as well. We're gonna have to check that out. I don't know how those prices have changed for that, but we will have to see. Next pack, we have Diverge of the Nordic. We got the uh, Ghost Trick Break and Destiny Hero Dasher again. Okay, too bad it's not 15 bucks anymore, but let's go into this special edition real quick before we get back to those other packs. But wait! Did you know that Mega 10 2022 pre-sales are out? Use my code MightyRuxin30 if you want to get $30 off with Sassy Auto's link. It also supports me as well. If you haven't heard about the reprints in these tins, they're reprinting Dark Magician Girl, Red Eyes, Dark Magician, and Blue Eyes with new artwork. And they're also reprinting a bunch of new cards like Red Eyes, Dark Dragoon, Forbidden Droplet, Nibiru, Ash, Ghost Ogre, and many more. So make sure you guys use code MightyRuxin if you guys want to save $30 on your pre-order tin and it supports the channel. So let's get back to the video. We're going to with a dark magician tin which by the way was bought by benjamin he bought it and said he wanted it to be open on video so shout out to benjamin in the comments make sure you guys let him know that you appreciate it because pretty epic uh, extra con stardust dragon is a super rare in these uh special editions that is insane okay all right we'll take that that is an amazing promo all right three packs of shadow specters let's see what we can do all right we got a ghost trick vanish uh we probably should have done one two three four let's do three okay Ghost Trick Spectre, we got Gaia Tag, Cha Cha Chan, Ghost Trick Witch, we got the Ghost Trick Jiangshi, Secret Sack Drew Drew, The Vivid Knight, and a Resetsu. Resetsu. All right, Resetsu. Very cool. Two packs to go. Until we go back to those OTS packs, let's see what we can pull. Two, let's do three. We have Ghost Trick Spectre. The Prom Princess, the Princess of Ghosts. Very epic one. You love to see that. Malaseverus Fork. Okay, another epic one. It's a pretty cool set, not gonna lie. Vampire Gracie, I think it's considered one of the worst sets ever, but I really like it. Dragon Shield, classic Ghost Trick Vanish. Soul Drain Dragon. Vampire Duke. And. No way! Oh my goodness! A ghost rare, Divine Dragon Knight Felgrand. Bruh. This wasn't even the main event. Shadow Spectre Special Edition, and we pull a ghost rare? This, this is probably the most random ghost rare I've ever pulled. This is insane, and I love this card. Look how beautiful it is. I didn't even bring it up, because normally I bring it up, I'm like, I really like the, you know, the card that I, I never remember the name, but I'm like, the one with the ulti and the ghost in this set, it looks really cool. And there it is, we pulled it. All right, Ghost Rare, Divine Dragon Knight, Felgrand. We will take that. We got one more pack, all right. We're gonna get an ultimate rare as well when we get one of those, that'd be pretty amazing. We got the uh, Tyranitar, over, they're not Tyranitar, uh, Typhlosion over there with the wings. Survival of the Fittest, we got the Bujingi Ibis, Battle Boxer, Vampire Grace, how crazy is that? Soul Drain Dragon, Mega Phantom Beast, and oh, a secret rare, Malay of the Trees. So we get a ghost and a secret rare out of that special edition. That is literally insane. Yeah, and we still have these. We can get ultimate rares. We haven't even gotten to Benjamin's 10 yet. What in the world is happening? Oh my gosh. Baby Sarasaurus, a nice super rare. Very cool, very cool. I can't believe we just pulled that. That's unreal. A, a freaking random ghost rare. Phantom Knights of Breaksword. I don't know if I have that one for my binder or not. Uh, if you guys know about my ghost ulti and secret rare binder of all the... Uh, you know, the cover cards or the main cards. I don't even know what you call them. They're not necessarily the cover cards, but the cards that have a ghost rare in the set. They also have an ultimate rare and a, oh, Pika Felina. Ultimate rare, and usually they have a ultra or an ulti, or an ultra and a secret or a secret as well. Vampire Retainer, we got Incantation, and we got Phantom Knights of Breaksword again. That's not a very good one. We keep pulling that, unfortunately. It's not a bad card, but there's like a lot of printings of it already. 
Okay, Silent Boots, Dark Magician Circle, and the Token Collector. This is a very good one, actually. Very good to counter the Brave Engine, actually. Two packs to go, let's go. Will we get an Ultimate Rare? Diverge, Kagamusha Knight, all right, another decent one. Final pack of OTS before we get into that 10, let's go. Let's see, we have Vampire Familiar, Ghost Trick Break, and Dasher. A play set of these. If someone's going to play a play set of Dasher, I don't know. They're, they're probably going to lose, but we've got it. All right, on to the main event. We have a Dark Magician 10 for Benjamin, who bought it on the website, Ruxin34.com. Go check it out. We still have some 10s on there if you guys want to as well. They can be bought and kept sealed as well. You don't have to have them open. But if you do want them opened, I'd be glad to open them. Okay, we're struggling. Here we go. All right, let's get this thing open. 2003 Dark Magician 10. This is not the original. There was a 2002 first. Then the next year, they came out with this artwork in 2003. Well, technically, they didn't come out with this artwork because this is the LOB artwork, but the secret rare version out of this. Here we go. We have, okay, five packs let's see if that's a nice promo back there please okay wait is this a nice promo okay i can see a little bit of scuffing wait, let's get this yeah but it's really not bad that's about it right there right in the middle so a little bit of scuffing but not too bad so actually a pretty close to near mint card here that's really nice centering is awful so even if it was minty that you wouldn't be able to grade this probably but this is still a really nice version so this is really good because 2003 you usually don't get such a nice promo so that's pretty good i'm sure i'll be happy about that but wait 50% of you guys are not subscribed to the channel according to this graph. So go down below and click that subscribe button. We have our four packs. LOB, Metal Raiders, Magic Ruler, Pharaoh Servant, and Labyrinth of Nightmare. Of course, we start from the back with Labyrinth of Nightmare. Let's go. Sorry about my voice. I'm still recovering. Also, we did back-to-back -back three hour live streams with this voice somehow. So yeah, I'm trying to get through it. Here we go. Let's do one, two, three, four. We have a Boneheimer. Will we pull a foil for Benjamin? The Unfriendly Amazon. We've got Swordsman of Landstar. You love that card. Bait Doll, actually a pretty decent card as well. Miracle Dig, the Lightning Conger. Dancing Fairy, very cool. The Worm, a Drake. Oh, and an Ultra Rare United. We stand and check it out. Spell card, even though it says Magic Ruler on the Magic Ruler pack, it's a spell card. That's the different thing about 2003. They actually had both spell cards and Magic Ruler. Very confusing, but ultra rare right off the bat last time we opened one of these tins we went like one for ten well we opened two of these tins one for ten so he's starting one for one that's a good start and not only did he get an ultra rare but he had a nice foil as well or at least a nice uh, promo so looking good Ferris servant up next let's see if we can pull the buster belader let's do it all right we've got the cold wave a very strong card there one two three four very nice we have the deep sea warrior the kisa tie Oni Tank Ruxin 34. Beautiful. Tokuro Yaiba. Apparently a short print. We always pull it though. Cold Wave. The Gamble. Cyber Falcon. Shadow of Eyes. Oh, and a Prohibition. That was the rare. I didn't realize that was it. But this is actually a pretty good rare out of the set. One of the best rares, actually. It looks like three bucks, which, you know, it's not that crazy compared to the price of the pack, but still a good rare. Three packs to go. Let's go with Magic Ruler with spell cards inside. Very confusing. Spell Ruler Magic Ruler. I know. I know, pretty nuts. One, two, three, four. Can we get another foil? Can we get a Serpent Knight Dragon? We've got the Wall Shadow. This is a very epic classic monster from the anime. Epic classic. We got the Stone Ogre Grotto. The Gaia Power, very nice. Chain Energy. Toll, give me that money. We've got the Reliable Guardian. Oh, dude, look how many muscles this dude has. There's something wrong with those muscles. I've never actually noticed that till now. He looks like a bunch of meat. It's like ground beef. Uh, you might want to fix those muscles, buddy. I don't know what's going on there. We got the Spear of Cretan. The Weather Report. And... We called it a Serpent Knight Dragon. So we have a MRL out of the Magic Ruler. Serpent Knight... Wait, wait a second. MRL. Interesting, isn't it? Oh, you can't tell unless it's a magic card. Yeah, if it's a spell card, it would say spell up there, but it's still MRL. That always confuses me every time, so I like to bring it up. So if we had pulled like a, let's say a snatch deal, it would say spell card at the top, but it would still say MRL and come out of a magic ruler pack. Very, very confusing. I think it's the only time that would happen would be out of the 2003 10 or 2003 pack, which is pretty cool. Serpent Night Dragon Secret Rare. This tin is insane. Dark Magician, near mint condition, a ultra rare United We Stand, and a secret rare Serpent Night Dragon. Wow, that is amazing. And it's still MRL which is really cool and i can't like go too crazy because my voice is messed up but i'm still like this is amazing like even though i'm not getting as hyped as usual it's because voice just isn't cooperating but now we have a metal raiders a little bit of a fat pack no body shaming don't you worry harpy lady original artwork okay that's probably worth a little bit very nice let's see if we can get that classic pequeno moth let's see we got the Oguchi cheerful coffin lady de fe Oh, we got a Ruxin special with a blue wing crown, but don't worry, we've already seen the Harpy Lady. That's the classic OG artwork. Yadakuru, Big Eye, 
The Ring of Magnetism. Is this next one it? Could it be something amazing? Let's go. <laughs> I was about to say the might magical hat. White magical hat. There we go. I was like, mm, I couldn't, I couldn't uh, figure out what I was going to say there. Oh my goodness. The white magical hat. We streamed three hours and six hours total in the last two days. I'm losing it at this point. I basically lost it. No foil in there. No Bacanio moth. It's pretty unfortunate. But don't worry. A final fat pack. And no, we're not body shaming. We're just describing this epic, epic pack. Fat pack of Legend of Blue Eyes. Let's see what we can do. A 2003 pack. We have pulled a Blue Eyes out of this type of pack before. Let's see if we can do it again. We got four from the back. We've got a Dark World Thorns. Can we pull another foil? Because this has been an insane 10 so far. Red Medicine. We got the Kurama. Terra the Turrible. Numi Ruko. So good. We got the Mystical Sheep number two. Tripwire Beast, I think it might be the next card. What do you guys want to see? Will it be the Blue Eyes? Will it be the Dark Magician? Red Eyes, Black Dragon, let's go. The Dark Magician out of a Dark Magician tin. No way. And that definitely hurt to yell that loud, but it was worth it. Dark Magician 2003 print, not wave your glossy, just regular old unlimited print. Wow. So not only a secret rare Dark Magician, but the ultra rare as well. Look at this freaking tin. Two ultras, a secret, and then of course the promo secret. That is insane. Benjamin, you picked the right tin to open for sure. A Dark Magician ultra rare. That is insane. What amazing pulls, dude. Thank you so much for letting me open this up on video. Awesome, awesome pull. Super congrats to you. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic content. Shout out to TCG Trust Cards, Tomefo Show, Tomato Juice, Daxter, JT Cho, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanda, Squirtle, Flexi Boy, Dizzy, Stanley, Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, Ian Musa, Junior Barning, John Nolan, and Untai Show, Thomas McLean, and Seth Fisher. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.